In this report, I'm going to tell you the latest about Tesla Giga Berlin, what is happening at Giga Berlin today, where is the construction and what is Elon Musk doing there, as well as information about the Giga pressers being soon installed. Welcome back, dear friends. This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com. If you are here for the first time, please subscribe to our channel for daily Tesla news and ring the bell so you don't miss my next Tesla story. First of all, our friend Jürgen is reporting. Jürgen tweets at GF4, GF4 Tesla tweets that on the west side of the body in white facade elements are already being installed you're seeing uh, that on your screen and there is a view of the general assembly seat production from the west so this gives you a little bit overview thanks to Jurgen where Tesla gigafactory production is right now and also you'll be seeing some um, video materials from other our friends Albrecht and um, uh, our other friends, uh, Tabi, Tobias, uh, who show where the Tesla Giga Berlin production is going right now. Also, Elon Musk, Tesla CEO, is in Berlin at Giga Berlin in Grünheide, personally interviewing people, engineers. Yesterday, he wrote that he's looking for ace engineers, for the best engineers for Tesla Giga Berlin, and that will review them on site personally today. And I mean, look, how many CEOs of such great, uh, of such a big uh, grandiose i mean for such a big company uh, personally uh, interview engineers on site at the factory so i think it's a good a good sign for tesla and uh, just two hours ago elon musk wrote that when sending your resumes please describe a few of the hardest problems you solved and exactly how you solved them so these are the things that tesla ceo elon musk is looking for uh, to see in your resume if you are looking to uh, work for tesla La Giga Berlin and also regarding Giga Berlin we have another piece of information that Tesla Giga Berlin and Giga Shanghai will soon operate Giga Press die casting machines and uh, we, there is a video on the uh, Foundry Planets YouTube channel showing how they are being installed and that they will be soon ready to operate. You know, Tesla Giga Press, uh, the die casting machine, is a series of aluminum die casting machines manufactured by IDRA Group in Italy. We have a report, that, a report on that at Torque News. You can take a look at that. And uh, they are notable for being the largest high pressure die casting machines in the world with a clamping force of 5,600 to 6,200 tons force. Um, the initial usage of a customized OL6100 CS Giga Press is planned by Tesla for the production of the Model Y at the Fremont factory, California. But when it comes to Giga Press, we need to talk not about the size of the machine, but about how it will help to rethink the entire production process. I've reported previously that Tesla is abandoning hundreds of robotic arms, KUKA robotic arms, in favor of gigapressors. Tesla will um, put uh, eight gigapressors, die casting machines, at Giga Berlin, and that is supposed to make the cars lighter and improve the specs and the production of the Model Y vehicles and that are going to be started at Giga Berlin early next year, maybe in the end of the first quarter or the beginning of the second quarter, much earlier than the anticipated July 2021 date. The Giga Press purpose is to reduce build time of a car, operation cost and costs of manufacturing, factory footprint, factory operating costs, tooling costs and or quality of equipment. Tesla notes that it will reduce the number of casting machines required to build a vehicle frame and that could even build a complete or substantially complete frame itself. Maybe one piece or two piece. We'll see that it has pro, uh, pros and cons. Now on Foundry Planet, uh, the, the YouTube channel took a tour in the IDRA holes in the Travagliato, uh, Travagliato factory and shared a video of those giant giga presses. It's a very interesting video here. You're seeing some Im images on your screen and I will have the uh, link to that video in the description of this uh, video, friends, so everybody can, everybody can see. Um, let me know what your thoughts are on that. Now, at the moment, two machines have been installed and put into operation in Fremont, number one and number two. 
Also, according to unconfirmed reports, the three more machines are installed in Giga Shanghai. We have had per early reports at Torque News about that as well, but they are manufactured by LK Machinery. And now IDRA is disassembling this previously made Giga Press number three. And according to Foundry Planet's report, soon it will be going on a long journey. However, we have no information on where exactly this Giga Berlin will be sent. Since this is long journey, it's possible that the machine is going to Fremont or again to Shanghai for something, or maybe even uh, Giga Berlin, although Giga Berlin is not a long journey from, uh, uh, from Italy. But who knows, these are heavy machines. I don't know how they are transporting them and how long it will take for them to get there. And now at IDRA plant near Giga Press number three, there is a Giga Press number four that will be sent to Giga Berlin. The product, uh, the produce parts for the European market model Y, given the speed of um, to produce actually model Y uh, for Europe made at Giga Berlin. And given the speed of construction at Tesla's new, fa new factory, machine four will probably be delivered there as soon as the California company Fremont receives the final building permit from the Brandenburg government. This is expected by the end of 2020 but um, or the beginning of 2021. However, it seems, that, it seems that there are some issues, there are some delays according to RBB, which is German uh, Brandenburg's public radio, due to the issues discussed at the public meeting where they were discussing Tesla opponents and their public com comments. This is probably one of another reasons that Tesla CEO Elon Musk personally chose to go to Giga Berlin and, and talk to Brandenburg and German officials about the final permit because this is becoming already serious. Well, friends, let me know what your thoughts are. Let's continue watching this the two minute video by our friend Jurgen, who is showing the current uh, images and videos of what is happening right now at Giga Berlin. In the meantime, this is Armin Haryan. Please subscribe to our channel for daily Tesla news and ring the bell so you don't miss my next Tesla story. Have a wonderful rest of the day. God bless you and see you soon, everyone.